It was in the early 1800s that people began to flock to the beaches for seaside amusement. With the introduction of railroads, oceanside beaches became even more popular for sunny recreations. Along with this new outdoor pastime came the need for a stylish garment for the privileged lady of fashion. Annette Kellerman, c. 1903-1913 Publicity photo in her self-designed swimwear, considered rather daring at the time. Annette Kellerman, 1887-1975, was an Australian professional swimmer, vaudeville and film star, writer, and advocate for the change of women's swimwear. Two girls in zebra-style swimsuit, CA. 1906 Annette Kellerman reclines on diving board wearing her self-designed swimwear, 1909. Annette Kellerman in her famous custom swimsuit, CA. 1900. Beethoven, Heringsdorf, Ostsee, 1909. Swimmer Annette Kellerman, in her swimwear full length, lying on floor, facing front. Not dated. Probably late 1900s or early 1910s. Family in front of beach chairs, CA. 1900. Woman swimwear, CA. 1905. You. S. Singer and vaudeville star Arthur Fields, with his wife and child, posed in swimwear with hose washing their Stutz automobile, CA. 1919. Man and a woman with bathing machines in shallow water at a beach, CA. 1913. Phyllis Haver was a Mac Sennett's bathing beauty, 1917. Photograph of middle-aged man in swimwear of the era at Sea Beach at Bay St. Louis, Mississippi, 1914. People attending a beauty contest held at the Tidal Basin in Washington, D.C. 1919. The victorious English 400M Women's Relay Swimming Team at the Stockholm Olympic Games Postcard, 1912 Belle Moore, Jenny Fletcher, Annie Spears, Irene Steer Bernard Cyril Freiburg, later Sir Bernard, on a diving board over what appears to be the sea The steep hills in the background indicate that the location is possibly Wellington in the background a large crowd is watching the events taking place, 1914. Photograph of woman in swimwear of the era at Sea Beach at Bay St. Louis, Mississippi, 1914. President of Germany, Friedrich Ebert and others swimming in Lake, 1919. Family in a Beach of Borkum, 1910. William T. Burgess, who swam the English Channel on September 6, 1911. 
He was the second person to successfully complete a swim of the English Channel after Matthew Webb. Swimmer Claire Ferry, posing standing in swimsuit with her hands and feet bound by ropes, ca. 1910s. U. S. Singer and vaudeville star Arthur Fields standing on beach in swimsuit, holding bottle at his mouth to pose as if he was drinking, ca. 1910s. ca. 1900. American actor Gloria Swanson, 1899-1983, stands on tiptoes on the prow of a motorboat, while Teddy the dog sits with his paws on the steering wheel in a still from director Clarence G. Badger's film Teddy at the Throttle, 1917. Group of bathers being photographed at Hamlin's Point, Toronto, Canada, 1913. Jack London at Waikiki, 1915. Keystone Studios Bathing Beauties. Hollywood Film Women in Swimwear, 1916. Max Sennett's Bathing Beauties, posed on automobile, Washington, D.C. C.A. 1919. Alice Maison in bathing suit, standing with one foot in ocean, muff on right hand and left hand raised, C.A. 1918. Marie Prevost was a Max Sennett's bathing beauty, ca. 1917. Image of Mina Wiley, Dutch swimmer, Olympic silver medalist in 1912. Olympic Swimmers, 1912.